chasing the police every single day. Wow. Uh, yes, who would I talk to here about? Uh, I had an appointment the other day on a, a home phone call, video call with Rodney McGee, and they did not uh, put the camera there when they were supposed to, even though I filed a day ahead of time. Um, let me um, look. Who didn't? Visitation didn't? So, so I did it online. Okay. You know, I'm already registered, have been, you know, I've did this multiple times. Uh, so I got everything set up, you know, redid my schedule uh, to do a story with Rodney McGee, tell him what's going on, the illegal investigation. And they did not move the kiosk to his cell. I waited 45 minutes, and uh, this is all documented. And then I had to call here, and then uh, the lady was kind of snooty and snotty to me, saying, I know who you are, and we'll get it moved over there. Even though I'm, so I'm trying to find out how does a mistake like that happen? I mean, Aren't you guys all made aware? I would have to look at, I'd have to find out, um, I'd have to talk to the person that's out of visitation to find out what happened that day. Right. Do you know what day it was? Yesterday. Hold on a second, let me go get a piece of paper. I'll take all right. some information. Rodney McGee. Oh, now I had to stop and think. Yep. Oh, he's been here so much, I thought he had yeah, it memorized. I know. But I love him because he does pro se fights. I love him for that. And you had a visit scheduled for yesterday? Yep, 8.30 in the morning. And somebody was not doing, I don't know how you guys do it, but they weren't doing their job. They did not move the kiosk over. I was looking at the ceiling for 45 minutes. I had to call. Okay, and what's your name? Andrew Sheets. Okay, hey, Andrew, hold on a second. Let me look into it, okay? Because I wasn't here yesterday, so let me find right. out. Okay? All right. Whoa. Anybody there? Uh, unfortunately, oh, <laughs> I know. Waiting for a question, but you can go ahead. Thank you. I'm just here to pick up my grandson's clothes. Uh oh, that means they're going to keep him forever. Well, I'm not doing anything to help him. <laughs> uh oh. Do I push this button or will? Actually, yes, do it. Why? He actually is a bad kid? Not really. He's just on drugs. Oh. What do you do? Uh, stop the war on drugs. <laughs> yes, I'm here to pick up Jeremy Lawler's belongings. He signed them out to me. Yeah, L-O-R-B-E-R. -E Thank you. Terry Martin. Thanks, Mary. Yes, yes. Where is it? In here somewhere. Oops, sorry. Thank you. So, why, what drug is he hooked on? Any of it. Uh oh. I know. Meth. Oh. Any of it. I know. Yeah, meth is bad. You know, it's weird though. In, in countries where they did stop the war on drugs and they legalize it, everything mellowed way down. It's. 
You know how kids are. When you say no, they want it. Thank you. Correct. Yes. And unfortunately, in my opinion, they're doing the war on drugs here because that's more of a control factor. Uh, if they get you on a felony, they get your guns, you can't vote, so less voters. I don't know, it's sad. Well, the sad part is, too, I, I'm sh I don't know if you'd agree with this, he'd, he'd probably be better in a place for recovery, too, oh, right? I know. I mean, not here. Yeah, I know. I mean, did you hear they're actually ch they're charging you per day now, a, ch a charge to get in here? It's like, wow. Yeah. That's not it's, good. It's, it's not. And it's, it's really not right. They need to do something more to help some of them. Correct. Not all of them. Right. But some of them. Oh, she already got help. What about me? Okay. Um, yeah, there was an issue with your visit yesterday. Okay. You get an extended 45 minutes. That's true, but um, I, I took out of my time, you know, to schedule it in. So what, what was the reason for it? That, is this normal that they do this? Well, sometimes when there's issues, what you can do is you can call here. Because, right. Um, to let us know that you have an issue and we'll, re we'll reconnect you. All right, so do you do, you do this to everybody, no, it or it's rare? it doesn't totally happen all the time. There may be some inst inst instance where it does. Okay, did they say what happened then? They didn't get the notice, or? Oh, no, they got the notice. The visit was there. They just weren't aware that it, uh, that, um, it wasn't connected. What, so basically, what you... um, the visit was, you did get an extended 45 minutes. Correct. Because you had lost a total of 45 Correct. minutes. Correct. But, but you know, I, I, I can still have the right to come here to, to complain. Yes, I understand that. Okay. And what we did is, as, as a courtesy for you, we extended it. Well, it, was, it wasn't a courtesy. I paid, right? Right, but you still get your 45 minutes. I, I agree. Right. But it wasn't a courtesy, okay? Um, so I did pay. So I'm just trying to find out. So normally they get a notification. It's supposed to happen because because he was telling me this happens to him uh, a lot. Like they won't tell him somebody's been here. He he doesn't get I, mail. I haven't heard of that. That I don't know. Right. I don't know. Okay. So can we at least bring it up to the supervisor that the, to do their job? It is it is documented. Yeah. Actually, yeah, I did file a complaint because uh, yeah, that's how can you not. He's right there. I heard him talking while it's sitting there. There was a guard right near there. Yeah. So we, Rodney knows I was documenting. You guys record it, and so did I. I'm doing a story on this. Uh, his, and uh, so yeah, I literally heard a guard talking around it. So how could he not know? I. I wasn't here when it happened. Right. I'm just taking information. Right. That was so I'm letting you know to let them know. I, I, I literally heard a guard talking. So I, I believe they knew it was there. They knew it was on. And, you know, like I said, you know, are, are they trying to prevent us from, you know, talking about what's going on here and what's going on out here and the illegal stuff? I don't know. Just, I made a complaint. I came here. I was near here. And, uh, and I have the right. Thank you. So, yep. So, yeah, it's, yeah, they wouldn't even let me talk to uh, I, I I called a guy here. You know, you got to pay 16 bucks for one hour. Did you know that? Yep. If you do it from your house, it's 12. Uh, actually with video. So yeah, it's up to 16 now. So this is what I was going to tell you too. It almost seems like th this is kind of like almost policing for profit, right? Look at this. They they it's they get retarded. Yes, they make how they much money off of an iPad? Correct. I think that is ridiculous. Cor well, and then they charge a bunch of money for each thing sent. Mm -hmm. So th so that. So that's why they did that, so they can make more money on this. They're making money on this. Mm -hmm. They're making money on that. Uh, see the food here? I heard it's oh, outrageous it expensive. I've done it. Can I give you my card? You never heard of me? You never heard of Cop Watch? No. So, so we, uh, we fight police corruption. We're for police, just not corrupt ones. And as you know, there's a lot of them here. Uh, so anyways. I can't tell you how many times that this young man's father got beaten what? by them on drugs. I'm serious. He was on drugs, too. But that doesn't give him the right to beat in him. In Sarasota County, you should have seen some of the photos of him, how they beat him. 
I'm serious. Did he, did he assault them, or they just like to beat him? Uh, he'd run. And Still beat. doesn't give them the right to I beat him. I, I know it. There's a lot of crap that goes on. It's terrible. At least they're not doing like Northport's doing. Did you see what they're letting their dogs do? Uh, yeah, tear <sighs> them up. I've seen it. Did you see that guy's arm? Mm -hmm. he, that dog almost, they almost had to take his arm off. I know the guy. Almost. And did you know that to this day they still want to charge the guy? When you watch the video, he was on the ground, passed out. They want to charge him with eight years, even though they illegally let the dog eat his arm. Yeah. Is that right? No. No. This world's gone nuts. It really has. It has. <laughs> Well, so I'm on Facebook and YouTube. Look up Sherwood County Cop Watch. I'll come up and uh, what, what was your name again? Terry Martin. My name is Andy. Very nice to meet you. Uh, good to meet you. And if and if you know if you want me to tell the story, you know I don't have to say his name, but my email's there. If you want to send me the pictures, if you have the pictures, I will gladly. Yeah, see, this was a few years back. Quite a few now. I don't know. Right. Yeah. But. Well, if you ever get anything like that where you know that wasn't right, yes, if you that's bad if you run, but it still doesn't give them the right to beat you. I know. You're saying that bad? Oh, yeah. It was bad. I'm serious. <laughs> what? His whole face or everything? Mm -hmm. This was before tasers or? Oh, they tased him too. <sighs> Did you know that's electrocution? The body was not meant for that? I know. You know how many you things can happen? All kinds of Very things. good. You are awake. Oh, yeah. Did you know an electric fence can't even have that much electricity as a taser? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And they're... They're hitting people with it all the time. They just... I don't know. I don't feel I'm free so anymore, bad. man. Do you? Uh -uh. Do you remember freedom? How, how young oh, are you? Yeah. How young are you? I'm 62. Okay, I'm 53. I'm from 1983 in Grand Rapids, Michigan. In high school, I'm not saying it's right, but I did... I smoked pot, sold a little pot. It wasn't right. a big deal. Right. Do you see now what they're doing to schools now? Oh yes. Two cops in a jail and everything is illegal. I know. Would you want to be in school right now? No, I wouldn't. When I was in school, I had fun. Did you? Yeah. Yeah, fun is not allowed anymore. But a lot of things have changed since then. The, the people yeah, have even changed. I know, but it, every All time... This gun business is but every time they say for your safety you lose another freedom yeah you know what i mean oh yeah if you give away all your freedoms you have no that's right freedom that's right and you're what nazi germany yeah socialist fascist exactly what you're trying to do i think i really believe oh that. i really i do believe that i, I preach it for six years mm -hmm. by the way i was i know i was doing the right thing because i had a youtube channel that had 70 million views oh, wow. do you know who took it down the sheriff <laughs> i'm sure because i was telling the truth uh -huh. So can we even tell the truth anymore? Nope. Nope. We have no right of speech, period. Wow. Unless it's to their advantage. You are good. You better email me, man. <laughs> okay. I like you. Good to meet you. Good to meet you. Sorry to hear about your grandson. All right. You too. have to add this to the video. Uh, this is the cops. Is this your car, teen driver? Yeah. Is it really? Where's the other guy that gives out illegal tickets by the school? The guy that gives out illegal tickets by yes. the school? Yes. Yes, the, uh, the other, uh, not, don't be mad if I say it, the other fat guy that has this car, like it, uh, that one school over there, 41, uh, they have no signs on one of the drags. I was going down there, and uh, I have no freaking idea. I have no idea. What is it? What is it? Where Long John Silver's used to be? Remember on 41 and Port? Elementary. Yes. Yeah. There's that one road that is not properly marked at all, and he popped me there. How am I supposed to know if it's not properly marked? Uh, you'd have to talk with the Florida Department of Transportation about that. And that, They're the ones that mark it. You knew. You, why, do you know who I am then or no? You really? Can I give you my card? Uh, sure. Okay, I'm, I'm going to reach for my bag. Don't freak out. <laughs> Anyways, uh, my name is Andy. I'm a reporter for Cop Watch. I have okay. been for six years. I'm unfortunately experienced corruption here. And that ticket was one of them. And, and, and I did research it. I, I contacted FDOT. I contacted the sheriff. I contacted oh, Charlotte yeah. County. Well, I know, but nothing happened. They still don't have none of the signs on the road. Uh, so maybe it no wasn't... Posted illegally then. No, it, 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 there's nothing there. Go back, 
You know what? You can even use Google Street View. I, I even did that. I went I there first. I, I drive down there all the time. Yeah, okay. One way coming in 41, yeah. that's fine. The other way, eh. It's a sign posted right there on the right. says it's, that's speed not, zone. When you, look, when you look at FDOT, guess what you're supposed to have? On the road. I don't know. I don't work for FDOT. Uh, I'm not really sure. No, I know. Okay, I know. But I, I looked it up, and, and they are. And uh, I fought it with the judge, and he still fined me anyways, even though I got a clean record. That's not yeah. right, right? About your record? No, I mean that I got a ticket when it's not no, properly be, marked. That, that would be between you and the judge. I, I would disagree. I believe it would be properly marked, or you wouldn't have gotten well, a ticket. Well, in Charlotte County, I think they just give out tickets anyways, just as an opinion. Yeah. Uh, oh man, another one. That. No kidding. But listen, we gotta go. Wow, is this the guy that did you? Are you the one that pretended to be Ian's friend in court? Mm -hmm. Somebody went to eat one of Ian's uh, court things and said, I'm your friend. We found out later he's a cop. Uh, I don't know about that. I don't know Ian either. Right. Well, go down the other, go down the other way, day. down that road, and you're going to see it's not properly marked. It's not. And then you look up F dot, and it's absolutely not marked properly. By the way, was this confiscated, or you guys bought it? Uh, I don't know. They like the conf. Okay, what's your opinion on uh, them stealing 200 grand from that guy? Uh, constitutional or no? I have no idea what you're talking about. I gotta go to the school though. Ah, man. Why, a little kid did something wrong? That's sad, man. These youths who may want to retaliate against him physically. Hey, Sheriff County, this is Sheriff County Cop Watch, and I just wanted you to know that uh, I am using this stuff under fair use. And uh, also, uh, remember to like and subscribe this channel. Uh, also, too, uh, keep in mind, I do not make any money on YouTube. Uh, this is uh, five hours work a day, uh, you know, fighting for freedom. And uh, I do, I, you can donate with PayPal and Patreon. Uh, I just want you to think about this. If everybody gives uh, to PayPal and Patreon, Patreon is every month. Actually, PayPal you can do every month. I have 12,000 subscribers. If everybody gives, I can uh, quit my regular job and go full-time investigations on Charlotte County and possibly even more and beyond. So just keep that in mind. If everybody helps out, I can go full-time doing this.